everyone this is uh, dr niti now today we are going to explain the uh, evaluate uh, this integral problem evaluate uh, integral of 0 to pi root of uh, 2 into 1 plus cos theta d theta okay uh. now we are going to explain this uh, evaluate uh, integral first of all uh, here write the given integral what is the given integral here uh, given that given that integral of uh, integral of uh, 0 to pi integral of 0 to pi root of uh, root of uh, 2 into 1 plus uh, cos theta d theta this is the given integral now solving this integral means first of all we are going to arrange here integral of 0 to pi um, square root of 2 uh, dividing uh, separately right here next then root of right uh, 1 plus uh, cos theta d theta 1 plus cos theta d theta okay or uh, next of all uh, uh, that implies uh, that implies uh, here right uh, integral of uh, 0 to pi integral of 0 to pi square root of 2 into root of uh, 1 plus cos theta square root of uh, 1 plus cos theta means according to the trigonometric formula here right uh, 1 plus cos theta means uh, 2 cos square theta by 2 this is the um, formula for uh, compound angles uh, the trigonometry okay uh, next of all uh, root into d theta okay uh, next then go to right uh, implies uh, integral of uh, 0 to pi square root of 2 into again here square root of 2 again right uh, square root of uh, cos square theta by 2 into d theta here root square gets cancels next then write that implies integral of 0 to pi square root of 2 into square root of 2 into cos theta by 2 cos theta by 2 only cos theta by 2 is there here root 2 into root 2 means 2 that implies here write integral of 0 to pi um, root 2 into root 2 means 2 2 into cos theta by 2 cos theta by 2 d theta okay oh. next of all uh, integrating this uh, here 2 is the constant right uh, before the integral that is uh, that implies uh, 2 into integral of uh, 0 to pi cos theta by 2 into d theta okay uh, next that right uh, that implies uh, that implies uh, here right uh, 2 into integral of uh, okay uh, here uh, integration of cos theta by 2 means uh, sin theta by 2 again theta by 2 means 1 by 2 here right uh, after integration delete the integral symbol cos theta by 2 means uh, sin theta by 2 sin theta by 2 again theta by 2 means uh, 1 by 2 right uh, denominator y because this is the integration next uh, adding the constant plus c and also after uh, integration substituting the limits means uh, here um, 0 to 0 to pi okay uh, here substitute after integration uh, limits 0 to pi that implies here right 2 into 2 into substituting the limits first of all uh, here denominator 1 by 2 after uh, we'll get to transpose right numerator means 2 2 into this is uh, sin theta by 2 sin theta by 2 substituting here limits uh, 0 to pi 0 to pi next that uh, that implies uh, that implies uh, here 2 into 2 means uh, 4 4 into um, cos sin theta by 2 in place of theta 
you are substituting first of all upper limit and then lower limit this is called as upper limit and this is called as lower limit first of all substitute in place of theta upper limit that is sin pi by 2 sin pi by 2 minus sin 0 sin 0 okay next that that implies 4 into here sin pi by 2 means sin 90 degrees uh, sin pi by 2 means sin 90 degrees means here pi means 180 degrees 180 by 2 means 90 therefore this is the sin 90 degrees sin 90 degrees means 1 minus here sin 0 sin 0 means 0 according to the trigonometric ratios here using the formula sin 90 one of the trigonometric ratio formula 1 and then sin 0 another trigonometric ratio formula 0 therefore that implies that equals to or 4 is the answer this is the answer uh, the given evaluate integral integral of uh, here 0 to pi integral of 0 to 5 root of 2 into 1 plus cos theta d theta okay oh, thank you